Is it just me or does back to school always feel like a new level of chaos? Whether it's class schedules, sports practices, parent-teacher conferences, or just any other event going on during the year. Whether it's back to school or maybe running a small business and keeping all of this straight, it's really a full-time job. Now we've tried like the whiteboards and chalkboards and most of the time we go back and look at them and they typically have things written on them from six months ago. So if you're anything like me, those really don't work for you. So the next best option is a smart calendar. Now there are a few companies out there, but we have been checking out for a while the DAC board. While there's not a whole lot in the box, this system runs on a quad-core Cortex-A76 64-bit processor at 2.4 gigahertz with two gigabytes of RAM. And it also runs on a modified version of Raspberry Pi using their own operating system called DACOS. Now this is the DAC board CPU. They do offer a variety of different options. You can buy just the CPU unit and hook it to a monitor, or you can buy pre-built versions too. The great thing about this is you can use their platform to set up your schedules. You can connect it to Google Calendar as well as completely customize it. To fully customize your DAC board, you're going to log into the DAC board platform through the website and you have all these customization options. You have these things, what they call blocks, and they give you tons of different options to select or connect to different sources, as well as even submit some ideas if you want something more specific to yourself. But these are super easy to add to the DAC board as well as connect to those different platforms. You can see here there's plenty of different pre set up templates if you want something for a calendar and then you can go in and set up and change it and customize it there's also some community based ones that have been built that you can easily load along with you can see my different authorizations as well as background options that i've uploaded the online platform to control and customize the DAC board is not only easy to use but tons of customization options as well while some of these big pre-built smart calendars can be pretty expensive, as well as some of the screens, just they're really way too big for what I would need, I have found a way to convert this DAC board to be able to use a smart monitor that's touch capable. Now, at first I did try the DAC board with just a standard screen without touch capabilities. And for me, it really didn't work because I wanted to be able to look into an event or maybe add a new event. And I just know for my family that will not work as a static screen. Now for some things like businesses, whether you wanna put up a menu or just events in an office setting that could work perfectly because you don't want people touching that but for me and my situation i wanted that touch capability without a giant screen to do this so i picked up this portable touch screen got it working with this which was really easy to do and now i have all those capabilities that a touch screen would have and pretty much because it's only like a 16 inch screen i could put it essentially anywhere now, the one thing that I do like about using this size screen is, yeah, you can mount it to a wall, but you can also put it on a countertop perhaps. And then you can have things like weather updates as well as, you know, all of your calendar events that's touch capable. And you can see your to-do list and even more using the DAC board interface to really customize it to what you want it to show. Now, if you want to get it to work with a touchscreen monitor, there are some requirements that you will need to look at on DACBoard's site. With the DACBoard CPU, you do have a lot of capabilities here with all the different ports, as well as the expandable SD card. This would be perfect for the busy family to keep track of all those schedules, whether it's for school, you could use it for a small business, a restaurant, cafe, if you want to just display like menu items without having someone be able to touch that screen. So there are a lot of different options here. It is super compact. You can pretty much set it up wherever you want. There is a LAN spot, but it also Wi-Fi is built into this. So if you're like us and essentially struggle with calendars and to-do lists that are manually written, then this device right here may be something that you wanna check out as well.